Okay, so here is our MTS3 smart metering breaker. So you see each of them, we get the connected with the pin, six pins, power supply and also communication. Uh, so here we are going to connect all of them and we firstly get the power supplied because this communication power uh, module it requires for the uh, it requires for the time it requires for uh, time to do the configuration so this one is the Wi-Fi hotspot and also the RG45 and this here it is the MAC address with ends with B3C and uh, you see this is the power supply it the input is 230 volts and output is uh, 12 volts DC also it has lightning protection maximum 15 ka so this is the rcbo it's working now because it's power supplied by this one 12 volts dc inside to generate the motor the metering for each of them and also the communication power all of them but here we have we didn't install the cables this is a working uh, volts 230 volts okay so here you see only when the lights lights is uh, stable to uh, without blinking it means the the signal is uh, stable now so i'm going to do the configuration of app and uh, our device here we firstly go to our app we have chinese and the english version so but before that we need to uh, connect with the wi-fi here you see our Wi-Fi communication. We firstly, when this communication uh, set up, it will generate this signal B3C. It is the same as the MAC address B3C. Okay, so we do this communi communication, and uh, the password it is uh, eight times eight. One, two, three, four, six, seven, eight. Okay, okay sorry. So eight times eight. Now it's get connected with the device. Okay, it's already done, connected. And then we come to our APP, here it is. Now we are going to add a new IMCB. Add a new IMCB and the scan QR code. Here I'm going to scan the, this QR code, it is uh, here. Okay, so it ends with the B3C. And uh, here the password, it is admin. A D M I N, and the name you can name whatever we want. For example, test, test. Okay, so saves, saves, saves. Okay, success. Very easy. So we choose this one B three C. This is the one, and then we come to the master switch. For example, all switch off. Yes. So all starts to work. And you get a feed. Okay, so you can play whatever you want. Switch on off. And also you can come to the master. Uh, switch off. And or on. Okay, you always get a feedback. But uh, you see, if for example, if we if we want to add more more device. Now we are going to put another two breakers inside. Okay, we get it connected. All right, and then we get it power supply. So when this one uh, start to work again, now here you see uh, in the master we see only three, but here we have plenty of. And then what we are going to do to find these two newly added product. Uh, device so we come to here name and uh, name and limit and uh, to do the setup uh, modify. here we are going to show you how to do it so firstly come to here off the all circuit break and then start so off all of them okay so they are all uh, flashing now so start and now Press the first button. Now you see each button they are flashing now. Waiting for five seconds. Remember, five seconds. And all these buttons are flashing. And then finish. It will recognize all these breakers if they don't see them before.